Arkansas looking for awesome quartz crystals. Yeah, like when you first start, always start at the very, very end because they'll roll all the way, just barely be covered. You can find points like that, just barely under the uh, bus. Yeah. Wow. Nice one. You can take a break. Yeah, <laughs> Way to dig. <laughs> this load it's the last load for the day and you can see it's covered in this clay from the pocket and look at these little clusters we're getting out of here
close up on this amazing boulder that they dumped here. And check it out, it's just covered in points. Perfect little jewelry points. So here's a ton of amazing perfect points that Frank has pulled off. And we're also going to keep this big clump of clay to wash it off later and see what little points come out of it. crystals are so sharp that I got cut and didn't even realize it and a few months ago someone told us that if you put this clay on it it'll stop the bleeding and it worked <laughs> here's our buddy Bill how you doing Bill Good. Yeah. he's got his right So this is day one at Ron Coleman's. This was from the little pocket that we found that was stuck to a boulder. It was covered in clay. So all these points over here came from that. Lots of double terminated, super cool, y'all. This was actually from the 20 year old tailings. And then a lot of these were from uh, a couple new piles they dumped yesterday. But Kendall's gonna show you up close some of our favorite finds. Yeah. So let's get to it. <laughs> So this cluster right here is super unique, as you can see. It has a really awesome formation, and it's been rehealed several times and filled with iron, which gives it that awesome color contrast. So this is a super unique piece. I love it. Here's another really awesome piece. So this one grew like a scepter, as you can see. It starts from big and goes down to small. And I love how unique this one formed. It has a key in the back and it's super clear. So these ones right here are beautiful. They are water clear and a really good size. These things are gorgeous. On the back, those tiny crystals are called barnacles, and they're some of my favorite features that crystals form. Arkansas quartz crystals are renowned for its clarity. Just look how clear that, that crystal is. So this one right here has an absolutely perfect point. So we're digging in tailings piles, and sometimes when the dump truck unloads its piles, the points can get damaged, which devalues it. But as you can see, this one held up really good. And check it out, y'all, it's double terminated. So most of these that were still in the clay held up really good because it acts as a protectant. So I'll show you a few up close. These crystals are so clear and so pretty. Take a closer look at this one. So it has barnacle formations, but every single barnacle is double terminated. That is too cool. This one is one of my absolute favorites of the day. Frank was able to pop this bad boy off in one piece. It's all rehealed on the back. 